The Pennsylvania COVID Update 4, December 5, 2020. The Pennsylvania Department of Health provides updates on COVID-19. Currently, there are 5,230 patients hospitalized and 1,065 patients in the intensive care unit. This is the highest daily increase of 12,880 additional positive cases of COVID-19 for the year. The Pennsylvania Department of Health today confirmed as of 12 a.m., December 5th, that there were 12,880 for additional positive cases of COVID-19, bringing the statewide total to 411,484. This is the highest daily increase of COVID-19 cases. There are 5,230 individuals hospitalized with COVID-19. Of that number, 1,065 patients are in the intensive care unit with COVID-19. Most of the patients hospitalized are ages 65 or older, and most of the deaths have occurred in patients 65 or older. The trend in the 14-day moving average of number of hospitalized patients per day has increased by nearly 3,800 since the end of September. The statewide percent positivity for the week of November 27 to December 3rd stood at 14.4%. The most accurate daily data is available on the Pennsylvania Department of Health's website, with archived data also available. The number of tests administered within the last seven days between November 27 and December 3 is 405,631 with 59,817 positive cases. There were 70, 469 test results reported to the department through 10 p.m., December 4. As of 11.59 p.m. Friday, December 4, there were 149 new deaths reported for a total of 11,262 deaths attributed to COVID-19. County-specific information and a statewide map are available on the COVID-19 data dashboard on the Pennsylvania Department of Health's website. Mask wearing is required in all businesses and whenever leaving home. Consistent mask wearing is critical to preventing the spread of COVID-19. There are 22,150 individuals who have a positive viral antigen test and are considered probable cases and 642 individuals who have a positive serology test and either COVID-19 symptoms or a high-risk exposure. There are 2,900,640 individuals who have tested negative to date. Of those who have tested positive to date, the age breakdown is as follows. Approximately 1% are ages 0 to 4, 3% are ages 5 to 12. An estimated 5% are ages 13 to 18. The greatest rising group is 12% of ages 19 to 24. Nearly 37% are ages 25 to 49, while 22% are ages 50 to 64, and 20% are ages 65 or older. The Department of Health has seen significant increases in the number of COVID-19 cases among younger age groups, particularly 19 to 24-year-olds. An alert was sent to healthcare providers about the changing COVID-19 case demographics. Increases among 19 to 24-year-olds from April through the end of November are as follows. Southeastern Pennsylvania had nearly 5% of cases in April rise to nearly 11% of cases in November 2020. Northeastern Pennsylvania saw the percent of cases in this past April rise to nearly 13% of cases for November. In the North Central region, they saw approximately 7% of their cases in April rise to 14% of all cases last month in November amongst 19 to 24 year olds. For Southwestern Pennsylvania, 5% of cases in April rose to nearly 10% of all cases in November. Northwestern Pennsylvania has seen 7% of all cases in this group in April rising to approximately 10% of cases in November. And finally, South Central Pennsylvania had approximately 7% of cases in April rising to approximately 8% of cases in November. These aforementioned numbers are a regional breakdown of the increase in COVID infections amongst 19 to 24 year olds in the state. In nursing and personal care homes, there are 38,852 resident cases of COVID-19 and 7,135 cases among employees, for a total of 45,987 at 1,327 distinct facilities in 65 counties. Out of our total deaths, 6,931 have occurred in residents from nursing or personal care facilities. A county breakdown can be found at the Pennsylvania Department of Health website. Approximately 15,455 of our total cases are among health care workers. Statewide, the Wolf Administration has, since noon, December 4th, aligned the Commonwealth's COVID-19 quarantine guidance with the CDC. 
The Wolf Administration stresses the following role Pennsylvanians can play in helping to reduce the spread of COVID-19. Wash your hands with soap and water for at least 20 seconds or use hand sanitizer if soap and water are not available. Cover any coughs or sneezes with your elbow, not your hands. Clean surfaces frequently. Stay home to avoid spreading COVID-19, especially if you are unwell. If you must go out, you are required to wear a mask when in a business or where it is difficult to maintain proper social distancing. Download the COVID Alert Pennsylvania Health Department app and make your phone part of the fight. The free app can be found in the Google Play Store and the Apple App Store by searching for COVID Alert Pennsylvania. Thanks for listening. I'm Carl Cimini. For PCTV, this has been your COVID statewide update for December 7th. Please stay safe and wear a mask. PCTV is your community access channel located in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Please sign up for important COVID alerts on PCTV's website or on our Facebook page.